guys i am back and i'm super excited because today i will actually be shooting something that i've been wanting to shoot for so so long and i know for a fact that you guys also are really interested in this and you always want to know um where i get my things or what my favorite items is for a certain season and stuff so today i'm bringing you a cotton on summer haul <laughs> which i'm very excited about and i think um, if you're a young girl, you would know that cotton on is so on trend at the moment and I thought I would just get a few things and show you um, what I think is worth the buck and really just you need for the summer to be on trend and to really look the part. <laughs> to make this a little easier, I thought I would just break it up in categories. Um, first I wanted to do outfits but then I thought these items are so versatile and I'm able to wear it with so many in so many different varieties that I would just rather do um, like more items um, and show you um, like a few of my must-have tops um, pants or bottoms um, dresses and jumpsuits shoes and then as well as swimwear and a few um, underwear that's really essential so stick with me um, i will do them in groups and then i will also show you how they fit on me um i decided not to try on the bikinis or the underwear just because i don't want to get demonetized and i'll just put on photos of the underwear and the bikinis um either on me or on a model um but yeah i hope you guys enjoy this and yeah hopefully you find something you like <laughs> first category that I thought we can start off with is um, tops because cotton on has the cutest tops at the moment and they are so on trend and I can literally wear it with anything I can dress it up dress it down so I thought I would just show you a few of my essential pieces so the first one that I have I when I saw it on the hanger I was like it looks so tiny and like a bit odd and I tried it on and it's one of my favorites now so this is what it looks like it's just a white um, strappy top and then it cinches in at the waist with a um, elastic and then it goes out a bit again so it looks a bit odd I would say just like this but then when you put it on it's so comfy it's so flattering and you can basically pair it with anything I usually like to pair this with a denim short um, and it's white so I love white and I can wear it with anything and in this one I went for a size small um, I would definitely say size it's, it's very like your normal size small this one the next top I have um, is really cute okay so before we go on I really I'm very into pastels and um, like I'm trying to be more colorful this summer because I've been stuck with black for the last few years and I'm really trying to break out of my shawl and just um, incorporate some color but I'm doing it in a very subtle way so I'm trying to use pastels and really just bring it in whether it's just a touch of color per outfit or the whole outfit colorful these have really been well this whole cotton on collection has really been my vibe because it's very pastel and it's very subtle color but you can also go over the top it's like you can go either way so the next top that i got is a pastel yellow um it's a cropped it's a cropped um t-shirt with a v-necked uh, v-necked v-neck and it's in this really nice um really like airy material so you won't die when you wear it in of heat um love the color love the color it's super v-neck so it's quite flattering and it shows a bit of your you know if you have it flaunted um so this is also very nice once again i like to pair it with things like denim um or even long pants or even like denim skirts is really nice and this one i also got in a size small um i would definitely say you are able to size down in this one as it is quite loose on the top so if you have a small bust then rather size down one 
the next top i got my gosh guys to say that this is probably my favorite top or tops wouldn't be a lie because i have two of them and i wear them so 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 much as you can tell i'm wearing one <laughs> Um, I just think it's so flattering um, this is the other one I have it's a blue one and I just think it's so flattering the halter neck um, and then it's cropped as well so you can either but it's like a long crop so you can either if you wear something high waisted you can always um, tuck it in or if you wear something a little low waisted it's just like a really long crop so it's not too short personally I'm not the biggest fan of things that are cropped yeah um so this is like a long crop which really works for me and i got it in this um like pastel khaki color and as, as well as i got it in this um like blue which i think is a nice blue like it's not a very oh, blue it's just a very nice pastel blue once again and i got these in a size extra small so i would definitely say size down um because then you don't have to wear a bra and it's just nice and fitting top i got is once again a crop top um so Cotton On currently have this range where it's like more knitted stuff, but it's like a, not a thick knit, it's like a summer knit, if that makes any sense. Um, and I actually have one of these sets in this knit, which I'll show a bit later, which I had first. And then I saw this and I was like, I cannot resist because the colors are just insane and I can literally wear it with anything. So it's this cropped knit. Um, it's in these colors like these pastel colors and I love it this is just such a vibe for me for summer and I can literally wear this with anything you can wear it with um, a long skirt a short skirt denim I mean it's endless and the colors just makes it even more endless and then it's um, also these straps are thick enough um, to actually wear a bra underneath which is really nice just for some extra support um, as well as the crop isn't too high up once again and this one i got in a size small and um, i would definitely say it runs quite a bit big so if you um are once again someone with a smaller um, upper body or bust rather size down the next top i got is a button up crop but once again it's a long crop i personally really really do not enjoy short crops because i don't like to show that much stomach just because I personally am insecure about my stomach that's my weakness um, but this is so beautiful um, you can once again dress it up dress it down and do with it what you want but it's this um, beige uh, button-up crop it's a really really low crop if that makes sense um, so your stomach necessarily probably won't show even if you have a really tall torso um, it's just so nice it's got this little bag detail on the top as well as the buttons and I'm very very into these natural neutral colors so this once again is so versatile and I got a size medium just because I like um, button-up shirts and stuff to be a little bit more oversized I think it's very flattering and there's a lot you can do with this last stop that I got has to be one of my favorites because you know i'm also trying to be really cool which don't always succeed in the whole cool factor but i'm trying and this i love because i also got it a bit more oversized um and it's just such a vibe at the moment so i got this t-shirt it's like kind of tie-dyed um purple and then it's got a little michigan detail right there and I like it because once again I got it in a size large so that's pretty large for me as well but I think it's super nice super oversized and you can just wear it with a short tuck it in a little and play with it and especially on those days that you feel a bit more uncomfortable in your, in your skin this is so great to just throw over next up we are going to move on to the bottoms part of this um, haul um, I think we should start with the shorts so in the shorts I have three different denim shorts well two different denim shorts and the one I have in two colors so the first one I have I've probably worn in the last two weeks six times um, it's so in fashion at the moment and I really didn't think this was gonna be my vibe but I am completely obsessed with it and it's this like mid-length I don't know what you call the length but like it's like just a cut off 
denim and um it's kind of like i call it a dad jean like it, someone it looks like i literally took my dad jeans cut it off and wore it and it's so cool um when it comes to cotton on denim i would definitely say i size down just because um any denim basically stretches so i'd rather buy it and it sits a little bit tighter on my waist and everything a little because i know within one or two wears it will stretch so i get a size um european 34 so australian six if that makes sense and i got this in this um like dark darker washed out blue color in the next denim that i got um is more of a short denim i personally have always loved a short denim pants and um these ones really just fit me really well and they just work with everything um i'll show you what they look like it's just this normal denim that's a little bit like undone here and at the back it's also just plain and i got this denim in this um like light blue washed light blue as well as in a i think the color they call it color white haven so it's not white white but it's not it's still to the normal eye it comes across as white if that makes sense and this one once again is exactly the same and i think denim like this is just super super versatile because you can literally do anything with it you can wear it with just a bikini you can wear it with a t-shirt with a, one of the cool tops that like crops so this is definitely must have and essential for your summer wardrobe and once again i got this in a size european 34 as well or australian 6. then we move on to the long denim i am so excited to share this with you guys because i have been struggling my whole life to find denim that fits my long legs so i am 181 centimeters tall which i think is five foot 11 five foot 12 or something like that um and to be honest i think my legs are 80 percent of my body and like a tiny 20 percent torso so i'm definitely not complaining i love my legs and it's definitely my strong point um but i do really struggle to find denim that is long enough and unfortunately with cotton on i've never really found one that's long enough until this summer until they decided this summer to bring out not one two two denim that is long enough for my legs and i cannot wait to share this with my tall gals out there because i'm just like super excited and these pants aren't even like ugh, pants it's like the coolest pants and they're tall enough i mean could i be any luckier so um i have two of them of course i would definitely not miss out on one of them so i got two contrasting colors um the one is this white haven color once again and then the other one is a black one and um i'm just so excited to share this with you guys so they they are both called um long straight leg pan pants 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 <laughs> gosh long straight leg pants um they aren't skinny but they're still kind of fitted um the white one this one let me just make it look a bit cooler here for you guys just let me tie it up so this is the white haven one um as you can tell it's very long it doesn't have any um rips in it and it's really just a jean you can wear with anything um i got this one this was the first one i got probably a month ago and i got it in this in a european 36 or australian 8 and it was fitting at the moment but then as i wear it it just really stretched or not stretched just normal denim it's quite a it's not a stretchy denim at all don't get me wrong but just normal denim it always just puts out a little so this one i am going to get tailored just because it's a little bit too big for me at the moment um so i would definitely say size down in these ones once again and then the black one i got i actually just got yesterday and i'm super excited because i could not find my size anywhere and then i walked into a shop and they were my size and i was like it's like it was meant to be so the black one is so cool if you know me i wear black denim weekly three four times a week that's just my thing so this is the um 
black denim one it's got these cool rips in the in the um, pants in front which just like random two rips it's not very ripped it's just two rips which i like because it's not too much and then once again it's not a skinny um but it's quite like still nice and fitted but straight leg and then it goes just straight down so this guys i think is my new favorite baby and i cannot wait to wear this every single day and this one i did get in a size european 34 so a size australian 8 and i'm very happy it's a little tight on the top um, but I know that it's denim and it will put out a little so my tall girls go get yourself a long straight leg from cotton on go get it now It's gonna sell out and you are going to be sad Okay, now we are going to move on to the next category which is going to be jumpsuits dresses and sets um, I'm kind of just putting those three together just to make it a little easier so the first one I got um, is once again this knitted material. Um, this I've already had for about a month now. They are still in store so you can still get them. And I don't know why but I'm currently obsessed with lilac. Um, never in a million years would I think that I would go from black to being obsessed with the lilac. But this has really just been a set that I've been wearing so much and is so easy and so cute and you just throw it on and you have a whole outfit. So it's a pants like this and it's loose and it like ties in at your waist. It's a little bit like high waisted and then it's got a matching top. Exact same color, exact same material so it goes together perfectly and once again it's a little bit more oversized so it's just really flattering because it just hangs and it makes you look very like chilled but really cool you know so these two are put together and i usually i never really wear them apart i usually just wear them together the only thing that i would say is and definitely wear a nude bra and underwear underneath just because um they are they can easily like sh like um be see-through but if you wear new underwear no one sees anything and no one would see anything but if you're gonna wear a black underwear under this yeah someone's gonna see it and these ones i got in the pa oh, the pants run quite large so i got a size extra small in the pants and then as i've mentioned before i like oversized things sometimes so i got a size medium in the top then seeing that we are on the whole lilac train now and i want to share with you this skirt i got so lately since when for like three months ago i started really loving um tight like midi skirts i think you can do so much with them you can wear them with a t-shirt and tuck it in a little and make it like really casual or you can wear it with a cropped thing and make it really sexy and cool so i got this once again as i said cotton on currently have this knitted thing going in the store and i'm there for it so once again it's this knitted material and it's just a midi um tight fitted um midi skirt it's quite high waisted so it's really flattering around your stomach and your bum and i think it's like one of those things where you don't show a lot like it's quite covered but the fit is so good that it's so sexy um so this is definitely a staple piece in my summer essential wardrobe and i really like to pair that with remember i showed you that um knitted um multicolor crop I think those two look so good together. Since we are still on the knitted train, um, I'll share with you a dress that I got from Cotton On. And I, this is just so versatile, once again, so sexy. And once again, so like sexy because you're not showing a lot and it's just very modern and stylish, I would say. Um, it's once again, this knitted material. And I got this in a beige. It just has a like not even a very hectic V line it's just a V and then it sits um, like body like tight to your body and you can also once again dress this up with a pair of heels go for brunch with the girls or you can wear sneakers which I'm more of a sneaker girl so I would just wear white sneakers with this dress it up with a few jewelries and wear a nice colorful bag and I am good to go um this i got in a size small and to be honest i would size down i would have definitely gone for an extra small if there was one but 
you know, it's up to you and how tight you want it. I would say size down. Then something that is so out of my comfort zone, I would say, but really surprised me for what it was, um, is this dress I found um, last week. I haven't worn it, um, but I can't wait to wear it because it's so out of my comfort zone just because I am not a very flowery girl. Um, I've just never been a very girly girl, if that makes sense. I've always opted more for like the sneakers and like the tomboyish looks. Um, but then I got this and I tried it on and I am obsessed. It is so flattering. And it's so funny actually because my boyfriend has this thing, if I wear a flower dress, he is just madly in love and it's not me at all, but he loves it. So this dress, I'm going to call my boyfriend dress because he is going to be obsessed when he sees me in it. And to be honest, I'm obsessed when I saw myself in this because it's just so flattering. So it's a, um, it has a top like this. So the material is like these flowers. And then it's on the top, it's like, t-shirt kind of ish then here you have this detail where it ruches up and you can ruch it up as much as you want um, here by your leg and then it's just a midi dress um, and then at the back you have a elastic that cinches in your waist a little um, it has black in which I think is great because I can wear my like black slides or burks with it and just really dress it up or down but then I can also dress it up and I can wear um, black like small heels and I can really just have a nice black handbag and you know feel like a woman <laughs> then the last dress that I'm going to show you guys I wore the other day on my Instagram and you guys went crazy for this dress and I can understand why because when I got it I wasn't like necessarily thinking this is gonna be the dress everyone's gonna love and me as well but then i put it on and it sits like a dream so this is gonna look weird now when i just show it to you like this um but basically it's a gray um dress that has this on the top like this it comes up quite high so it doesn't show anything here which is nice because you can Rooch it up and tie it up as high as you want. So if you want it long, you can make it long. If you want it short, you can make it short. And it's so flattering because it makes these like little folds and it just hides anything that you might be uncomfortable about in your stomach area. And you can once again dress this up, dress it down. It's such a versatile dress. And to be honest, I'm sad because I wanted to go get more colors and when i went back it was sold out which i completely understand because this is definitely my favorite favorite summer dress and i'll probably wear it way too much okay so let's move on to the next category which is swimwear and swim essentials and accessories okay so i'm going to show you three pieces of swimwear that i think is just so necessary for the summer because it's very versatile and there's something for every occasion the first swimwear I'm going to show you is a high waist. I personally have always loved high waisted bikinis. Um, just I think they're very flattering. As I said, I'm not the most comfortable, or my 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 insecurity is definitely my stomach. So on days that I feel a bit bloated, I really like to just hide it. And this is the perfect bikini to do that. Um, it's in this beautiful blue flowery color and it's a elastic bando type of um, high-waisted bikini bottom um, but it's still kind of flirty at the back if that makes sense so it's not too grandma-ish um, and then it's got this really cute bikini top with it that just really sits so nice it's such a strange design because at the back you have nothing you just have straps which i really like um, so I would definitely say this is great if you want to be more, a little bit more covered up or you are a little bit insecure about something like your stomach. Then the next one I have is more like when I feel a bit risky, not risky, just, you know, when I feel sexy. Um, and it's this like camo-ish green bikini top with a matching bikini bottom. And I think this is the... Um, Brazilian cut which I like I do not wear 
full bottoms it's just not for me i personally don't have a very round ass so it just doesn't look that good on me i just prefer to wear something like this where it accentuates my bums a little bit more just because need some help in that area um but this is super nice i love this color I, once again i like the neutral and the more natural vibe going and then i also have this with it which i haven't used but i thought it is so cute so basically it's like this waterproof um little bag as you can tell matches the bikini um this waterproof little bag which i use to put in my wet bikinis when i come from the pool or from the beach so that it doesn't make everything else in my bag wet so this is just a great essential piece to have to um help you not be wet everywhere what's this light doing and then the last bikini that i'm going to show you is so out of my comfort zone because it's really colorful and as i said i'm trying to bring in color but this is like really colorful but it looks so good on a tan skin i'm very lucky to um, have a dad who has quite an olive skin or a tan skin so i really tan very quickly i don't necessarily even tan i just move in the sun a few times and i have a good color so the reason I really like this first is because of the color and secondly because of the fit of the bikini top. So this is what the top looks like. And it's got the underwire which I really like in a bikini top. I just feel like it like keeps my babies, you know, good. And then it like goes in like that. It's just so cute. Like I'll show you a photo what it fits on or how it fits. But this is really cute. And then the reason I got this pants. Hear me out. I think my grandma will um, turn around in her grave and come give me a big slap if she sees me wearing this. But the reason I got it is because I, there's one of the things I fear most when it comes to summer is bad bikini tans or bad bikini tan lines. It's not a vibe for me. I'm too of a perfectionist to deal with that. So this is a bikini bottom that I got and I think it's called uh, a G-string bottom. So that's the back yes the back and that's the front and this bikini i would usually you mostly wear um when i want to tan a little and get a little color um i probably won't go to clifton in this and if i do come give me a high five because then it means i really do have a lot of confidence that day um so i wouldn't say this is for everyone but i would definitely say it's great if you want to use it for tanning even if it's just at your own house it fits great and i think it will really help you not to get any bad tan lines then if we move on to the summer bikini beach accessories i only have three things that i think is so essential the first one is this um white cover up it has these little buttons and to be honest i think i've worn it as a cover up once but i've actually been wearing it as just a button up t-shirt like like shirt and been wearing it with denim and stuff um it's this really nice comfortable like material i don't know how to explain to you the material but it's super nice and i got this in a size small last two summer things that i just had to get was two hats so as i said this one is um more on the beach like a little <laughs> summer hat it's like a woven summer hat and it's so nice because it has this wire in here so you can basically twist and turn it as you like um and it'll stay and i think it's just such a cute concept i think it goes with everything and i love that for me and then the last one as i said i'm a little bit obsessed with lilac so this one is lilac in the bottom and it's actually multi multi way I don't know, my english guys you can wear it both ways so this is the lilac side and then on the other side you have this really cute like a flowery pattern which i think is so cute especially with that lilac set that i wear i like to wear this hat with that um, and it's a bucket hat which is super on trend at the moment and um, i personally like it i know there's people who doesn't but i really really like this bucket hat i would just quickly let you know that these bikinis i would say it depends on your body i really enjoy the fact that you can buy them different sizes top and bottom um i usually go for about a size small on the top and a size small or medium on the bottom i don't like when my bottoms are too tight and they like 
push me so um push me that's my word push me like i just don't like it when it like pushes and it like ugh. so the bottoms i usually size up a little and then the top i just stay with a size medium um the tops are quite lenient so i think just try and find what works for you then we are moving on to sleepwear and underwear these are seriously just a few of my essential pieces and i'm actually very happy to share this with you because i've been using this so much so the first one we're going to do sleepwear i've got this freaking adorable once again it's a set set from cotton on um i think it's so modern and it's something i can wear as a mom even like anyone can wear this so it's your it's just a little top like that and then it's got a matching short like that um personally i think this this i love because i would wear this as my like sleep over pjs because it's very stylish it's very modern and i think i can wear this in front of everyone and anyone to be honest i might even wear it as a set with sneakers no one's gonna know it's PJs. So if you see me with this, it's PJs and I'm just rocking it as a set. And then the last pair of PJs that I just am obsessed with. So I'm not a very big Disney, like, you know, you get Disney fans. I'm not a Disney fan. Um, but then I saw this and I was like, I, can't, I couldn't, I physically could not resist. I mean, it's a huge top that I would wear as a like dress, um, like a sleep dress, and it's got Minnie Mouse, Mickey Mouse on, sorry, and then this just made me do it. It has these embroidered flowers on, which is just adorable. It's just adorable. Like I would feel so cute in this, and I love it. I love sleeping in like oversized t-shirts, so this is just perfect for that. And once again, it it like covers enough to wear in front of people which is great okay so then we're going to move over on to underwear so i'm someone who really has underwear for the practical reason of it um there's nothing i hate more than someone wearing underwear that isn't fitting for the clothes they're wearing and that like isn't correct so for me when i buy underwear it's much more about the practical use more than a layer look on speaking again but basically i just prefer to have practical underwear for practical use than having underwear that's cute and sexy maybe when i when i'm married i'll have it for my husband but at the moment i'm like it just needs to go with my clothes and not show then i'm very happy um i personally only wear g-strings i've never been someone who um really liked full panties i think also in my industry i'm just so used to wearing g-strings that there's nothing more that irritates me than a full panty that creeps up into my bum crack like a g-string just stays there and i'm happy then i wear a full one and i need to like constantly like it just goes and then it looks and i'm just like no it's not for me so here are a few of my underwear essentials the first one that i got is this high-waisted um nude g-string it's in a very stretchy nice material and to be honest i love wearing this with my high-waisted things because it's really high like it comes up high waisted and it's quite like a nice tight material so it kind of feels like it sucks in that lower pouch most of us have like it just sucks that in so nicely um so this has definitely been a fave um i usually get my underwear in a size medium just because uh once again i don't like when it's like too tight and you can see it under my clothes being too tight but these ones i actually got in a size small and they are perfect for me um i will link everything down below but they i think they are called the seam free high cut g-string brief in color new latte they have it in all different colors um so there's really something for everyone then the next underwear that i got i'm moving on now to like bras um i have three kind of bra tops here the first one is this um let me just see what it's called it's called a everyday bonded long line bralette color frappe um it is a seamless bralette like this um it sits super bodycon to your body and it like 
really you can wear this under anything and it won't show lines it'll still have the support you need and um, I think it's just a great essential to have especially for this color you can wear it under anything and um, I would definitely say size down I got a size extra small than this normally I am a size 34b bust so I size it down in this one um, and am I a 34b or am I a 36b let me just check I'm a 34b I was like oops so i sized down in this one um just because they have extra small small medium large extra large i think but i would definitely say size down in this one i've been in nude as well that i bought a few months ago but it's currently in the wash um so i'm just going to show you the black one but it's just a plain black bra um and what i love about this it is it has the wire underneath which as i said in the bikinis i personally really like the wires i just feel like they really like cup your boobs nicely and like just keep it there like nothing falls around it just stays um so it's got the wire and then it's got a really soft inside which is nice because i'm not a fan of padded bras i just feel like it just adds too much and then it's still kind of seamless up here as well so it won't show the lines as you wear them um, and once again i would say get this in black get it in nude because this you can wear under anything and i just got this in my normal size a 34b and I think they go quite big. They have quite a, 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 a big variety of bra sizes, if I'm not wrong. Then the last type of bra thing I got isn't a bra. It's supposed to go with tops because you buy it at Cotton On store and not at Cotton On Body. But I would probably more likely wear it as a like it's like a bandeau bra top underneath a blazer or with something super high-waisted um, or underneath something that I don't want to show so this I got in like a it's basically I think it's just called a it's called a rip tube seam free rip tube and it's like this it's like texturized like that and then it's basically just a tube you wear um, show you and I got this in this like uh, what color is called the color is called old rose and I got it in a size extra small so definitely size down because it is hella stretchy so size down in this one and then last but not least I bring to you my shoe essentials for the summer so I am very minimalistic when it comes to shoes I basically wear the same shoes either over and over or I just have a bunch that always travels with me um, and these are definitely my type of vibe so firstly this is very out of my comfort zone once again but I just thought that this was so nice for when I go to the beach um, or at like a coastal city and or town city town um, in December and to wear with like for instance my swimwear um, or even a nice dress because it's quite feminine so it's these like um plastic ish but it's like a matte plastic sandals um i think it's just so nice because you can really dress it up dress it down and it goes with literally everything And this I got in a size in a size of 41. I think all my shoes are actually in a size 41 because I'm a size 41. I think it's a from South Africa. It's a size eight. Big feet. I know. Call me big foot. Anyways, now that we are still on the whole sandal thing, I would show you my other two essential sandals. So the one <laughs> I love a little book and um i have black ones but then i got these white like dupes from cotton on and i've been wearing them to death so they are looking not that great at the moment but i've just been wearing them so much so here are the white ones um once again you can wear it anything i wear it with my bikinis i wear it with denim i wear it with dresses anything this goes with anything and then the other sandal that i have I really didn't think it was going to be my vibe till I got it and I'm obsessed. Um, it's this black, like it's quite a chunky heel and it's just normal two straps, fake leather sandal. And I wear this so much. I think between this and the Burks, 
they are my most worn at the moment so i'm very very happy with this and once again i got them both in a size um 41. then last but not least is sneakers i've always been a very big sneaker lover and these two i think you can literally just wear with anything you can dress it up dress it down once again and the one's like a little bit more boyish and the one's more feminine so this is my first go-to when it comes to sneakers um it's like a dupe of a um what's it called the one with the star all star so it's like an all star dupe and it literally goes with anything and then this one is just a plain white sneaker and i personally prefer white sneakers i also do prefer this leather because this is like a fake leather white i do prefer that to the white material ones just because i can easily wash the leather ones which is nice i can just um like you know clean it and i'm good to go and it looks new but these two would definitely be my summer essential sneakers guys so that was it i hope you enjoyed it i hope you loved it and I hope that you saw a few things that you liked and you felt you needed. Um, of course, I will be linking everything down below in my description. So you guys can easily just pop onto the link. And yeah, if you want more of these hauls and try on um, hauls, let me know. And I will do more. I will do more stores. Let me know which stores you like down below. And hopefully I can do a few more in the future and really give you guys um, the new trends and show you what I like personally. Um, I think it's so nice to share ideas and share tips um, I personally love watching videos like this from other people um, and I love just to see how everyone's styles are different and um, we don't all have to be the same so that's quite nice and I love the individuality that goes into every single video of people I watch and these are just a few of my favorites so I'll see you guys in the next video and yeah enjoy your week